So hello and what's up guys, Malex Mercury here again. So for another Chance of Impact Final Boss Beta Test. So last time we did the Kaya Star Quest. There's some minor issue about it, but yeah. Still good improvement by the way. I would like to send it for some feedback about that one because halfway through the dub of Yamon uh, it suddenly disappeared but overall it seems awesome so right now we're gonna head do the Amber quest since we are still Get to get the AR 10 as always and AR 15. So we will proceed to Amber's gliding session. So, no further ado, I won't be talking mu that much. And last time we didn't capture this one properly. So, hopefully, you will enjoy it much. So, I'm gonna check the settings. By the way, the settings also improve. They make available for Japanese, Korean, English, or Japanese Korean. The VA, the voice actor part of this game. So, for more info, that you can visit their main site and the link description below. So, no further ado, let's get started. Everywhere. How's that wind glider I gave you last time? <laughs> Seems like it's really growing on you. But then again, you don't have a gliding license, do you? A gliding license? Hmm, what's that? <sighs> Isn't it obvious? You gotta have a gliding license to legally glide in Mondstadt. Oh, but... We've been gliding for ages now. This is the first we've heard about it. Yeah, you've been gliding all over the place. Everyone's noticed. <laughs> so you came looking for us because you want to give us a gliding license? No way. The Knights of Avonius have strict rules. You need to pass an exam and only then will the Knights issue your license. Today, I'm here as an examiner to oversee your official gliding exam. I gave you your wing glider, so this is my responsibility. At least that's what acting Grandmaster Jean would say. An exam? <sighs> what a pain in the butt. Then again, since Amber is the examiner... No with a capital N-O. Do not challenge the authority of examiner Amber. I mean, the whole city saw how well you flew the day that Storm Terror attacked, so I'm sure you'll have no problems. But... We do need to respect the rules and glide properly. Here, take this gliding manual. No need to memorize it. Just be familiar with everything in there. For example, only one person per wing glider. No carrying anything over the set weight limit. No taking off using an animal slime and so on and so forth. Anyway, be sure to read it, okay? I had to read a load of big thick books too when Lisa was teaching me magic. Wow, that's a big old book. Great, come find me when you're done. I'll be at Windrise. So I skip that one. <sighs> the Knights of Avonius gliding manual does not sound like a fun read. When the first wisp of wind brushed across the land, birds that yearned for the sky had wings, but no way to fly. They asked the animal Archon, how can we reach the heavens? To which the Archon replied, you have yet to find that which is most important. 
As the Archon spoke, the winds thrust the seeds of a dandelion high in the sky. The birds thrust out their wings, but the breeze was all too mild, leaving them to stumble across the earth. So they went to the gorge where the wind showed off its wild and incomparable strength. They threw themselves into the gorge and flapped their wings amongst the howling winds until they were able to fly freely in the sky. To the animal Archon they went and said, It seems all we needed was a stronger wind to fly. The animal Archon replied, What you lacked was not wind, but courage. It is courage that has allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. Hmm, that's a cool story. But is the knight's gliding manual really written in that style? Huh. Anyway, let's go find Amber. So, that cutscene, I didn't show you last song, so... So, there's nothing else on the map last time, at CB2 it's just the same, and... Luckily they improved the loading screen, I like it that way. Also, the improvement of the graphics steadily improves. Anyway, we're gonna review this game as soon as we get enough data in it. Read-through of the gliding manual? Got all the rules down? Sounds like it was a real drag. I would know. I've been there. Ugh, oh, the gliding manual is super dry. I couldn't get into it at all. <gasps> Don't tell Jean, though. Really? Hmm. Paimon thought there were some pretty cool stories in the gliding manual. Cool stories? Oh, you must mean the example cases in the appendix. Some of them I like. My favorite one is about the illegal animo slime takeoff. Apparently, if you pop an animo slime and take off in the burst of wind, it shoots you up really, really high. I really want to try it. No, not that story. Paimon meant the one with the little bird who wanted to learn to fly. Uh, what? Let me take a look. Oh, shoot. This is the storybook I used to read as a kid. Oops, sorry. I put both books in the same pile and must have grabbed the wrong one when I was leaving. How in the heck do you confuse a bedtime story with an instruction manual? Uh, uh this is so embarrassing. It's because maybe deep down inside, that fairy tale is the thing that truly taught me how to glide. What you lacked was not wind. It's courage that's allowed you to become the first flying birds of this world. Reading that gave me the courage to glide, to become an outrider, and to become the gliding champion of Mondstadt. Uh, but anyway, let's get back to the exam. Don't be nervous. Just glide like you're used to. Okay then, you just need to follow the marked route to the finish. So, okay. So we have 60 seconds. Ah. Oh, okay. I thought I fall down there. You nailed 
Hilde. But it's no surprise, given the way you handle your glider in a storm. The next part of the exam is in Mondstadt. See you there. Don't keep me waiting. Alrighty then. You heard her. Back to the city. Let's not keep her waiting. And also during the fighting scene like this, the camera will zoom out. It's, it's kind of a good thing, basically. But it's kind of zoom too much. So let's go back to the city then. and get to the finish without stopping in the middle. Okay. of wind gliding now. Let's do the final stage. Easy! You've flown this way before anyway! Once you've passed this final stage, you'll finally be able to get your very own gliding license. Just keep thinking about that license. Ready? There's no voice yet. What's going on? Wait, I'm an instructor. This is a gliding exam. Really? Why? Well, if you need help chasing down a gliding criminal, I'm the one for the job. So tell me, which way did he go? Leave it to me! With us chasing him down together, he doesn't stand a chance. Once we've got this strange bird guy, we'll pick up where we left off. But no need to worry. I'll be sure to have a word with Jean. Hmm, okay. So, Otto, I don't have any dubbing yet, but for sure in the release, it will be Polish. Something like this one. It helps the player to understand more about the game. Ha 
So why would I do English dub if Japanese dub is available? Mm, as I noticed, like in TV2, there is no dub for story quests on Japanese Japanese dub or the Japanese VA. So I think much it's much more appropriate to do some English dub on story quests and Japanese dub on the Archon quest. So yeah. Um, just around here somewhere. Oh yes. Up ahead is Springvale. There must be some clues about Strange Bird around here. The sister from the cathedral put some secret animal markings on the artifact he took. Use your elemental sight and keep your eyes peeled for clues. Ooh, hey, what do you think this is? It looks like a broken tree branch. Oh, Paimon knows. It's from a frame of a wind glider, therefore... There are no elemental traces on it. Uh, it looks like it's just a plain old tree branch. Hmm, a strip of cloth with animal markings on it. Looking at the design and the way it's woven, there's a good chance it came from a wing glider. Wow, outriders have to be textile experts now? It's a harder job than Paimon thought. If this really belongs to Strange Bird, it must mean his wind glider is broken. Hmm, how do we know if this was left by Strange Bird or an Animo Slime? Animo Slimes are airborne creatures. They don't leave marks on the ground unless someone stumped on one to take off. Hmm, how do we know if this was left by Raptor or an Animo Slime? Hmm. That's not that's not correct one. Either way, let's make a mental note of these markings. They're very clear. It appears that the elemental markings point this way. Huh. Well, do you think he ran off ahead? There's only one way to find out. Come on, we should keep following the markings. Ooh, what's that? Looks like something's going on up ahead! That's the sound of battle! There's a chance it could be Strange Bird! Quick, let's keep going! This one too, there's no dummy in it. What happened? Hilly Churls, but I thought the Knights of Avonius had cleared out most of the Hilly Churl camps around these parts. Remind me of funny looking. In what way? Heavy object. The artifact? This could well be our guy. Tell me, did you see which way he went? Seems like a strong lead. On with the chase! 
Oh, and don't worry. As soon as I get back, I'll tell the knights to mop up the rest of the hilly churls as soon as possible. <laughs> All right, so let's continue. of wind gliders they've got, I'd say these lot are with strange birds. But if that's the case, what are they hanging around here for? I wonder. Well, this measly bunch can't slow us down, that's for sure. But we also... Huh. Look where we are! The elemental power on the artifact must have worn off. Strange bird must have realized the markings would give away his position and sent his minions to slow us down. That way, when the effect wears off, he can make his escape. He won't get away with this. After him! <laughs> Forget these guys. Come on, let's keep following the elemental markings. So, we need to upgrade the characters for a while. Hang on. So, okay, can you ready? Okay, let's go! There's only one way over there. Strange Bird must be up ahead. However, it looks like the only way we can catch up is if we glide. But there's a ton of enemies below! They'll definitely attack us after we take off! If we're gonna do this, we'll have to glide and defeat them in one fell swoop! You still had one stage to go in your exam, right? Yeah, but what's that gotta do with anything? How about we make this the third and final stage of your gliding exam? Are you sure that's how the exam is supposed to go? It's a custom version of the exam, designed by yours truly! Besides, the normal version of the exam wouldn't be fit for the hero of Mondstadt herself. So, what do you say? Woohoo! Good answer! Prepare for takeoff! Strange Bird awaits you once you defeat all these enemies. Then that gliding license is yours! Strange Bird. Alright, here we go. I think it's okay though. Right. Yeah.
You breezed through it. <laughs> You're a natural. I knew you'd be fine. All that's left now is to grab ourselves a strange bird. Let's go. for a little shock. Across. Ugh, he must be around here somewhere. Amber! Over there! You! You must be Strange Bird! There's no escaping us now! Oh, it is pretty high. And quite far. Hey, watch it! You're talking to a Knights of Favonius outrider! You'll be so- <sighs> You're right. Ugh, he's right there in front of us. If only we could glide across. <sighs> so how did he get across? Can you see anything with your elemental sight? No? Oh, okay. Never mind. Oh no! He's getting away! Ugh, we can't hesitate any longer. The only way to get across is to glide there. But, but... Don't worry, I'm the gliding champion of Mondstadt, remember? If Strangebird can do it, 
I can do it too. Paimon sees your point. If you rule out everything that's completely impossible, gliding is the only idea left. Remember that book I lent you? The one I thought was the gliding manual, but wasn't? The first birds couldn't fly. Flight was their reward for their courage to plunge into the canyon. <sighs> Be my witness. Strange Bird says I'll never make it. But if you listen carefully... The wind says I will make it, and that's good enough for me. Hmm, that didn't sink in. Like a good little boy. You're in for a little shock. from in the air, and it's the only one. It would be suicide to try and escape in the direction Strange Bird was going. In other words, the only way Strange Bird could have gotten out would be this way, past us. Aha! So he was just trying to fool us by acting smug in the hope that we smug. would just give up and leave. Little did he know, we're not so easily fooled. It was all thanks to your sharp thinking. Just like a wise man once said, once you eliminate the impossible, whatever remains, no matter how improbable, must be the truth. At the end of the day, gliding is seven parts technique, three parts instinct, and then 90 parts courage. What you did now looked more like 99 parts courage. Ah, uh, it was just like in my first gliding exam. I was super nervous, but in the end, there was nothing to be afraid of, and I passed no problem. I kind of missed that nervous rush in the exams I've done since then. It just wasn't the same. Um, sorry. Paimon thought you said you passed no problem. What do you mean exams since then? Uh, well, you see, the thing is, Mondstadt is all no glide zone this, no landing zone that. <sighs> Every time I get my license, it keeps getting revoked. I must have taken the exam about 15 times altogether. But I always pass the first time. I guess my little gliding manual ain't so bad after all. Let's go and get a copy of the real gliding manual from acting Grandmaster Jean sometime. I'll head off first because I need to escort Strange Bird back to the city. Once you're back in the city, don't forget to come find me at the cathedral. I'll issue your gliding license there. She just can't sit still, can she? Guess that's why she's the outrider. When this is all done and dusted, let's head to the cathedral in Mondstadt. <sighs> Getting this gliding license has turned into quite the adventure. Adventure indeed. Oh, training. Well, before that, we're gonna go to win rice. We're gonna heal up our characters. Uh, 
Huh. Right? Run along. This isn't a conversation. And the uh, cathedral seems so nice as always. Congratulations! Here is your gliding license! You're officially legal now! Yay! I'm not surprised though. You are a natural after all. Oh, and I'll sign you up for the next wind gliding championship! I glide so fast that no one can keep up. It's just me up there, on my own, gliding around. Ah, <sighs> it's kinda boring. Oh, fighting talk! <laughs> it seems you have no idea how terrifying the championship really is. Well, until I kick your butt in the championship, I wish you a happy, liberating, and above all, law-abiding gliding experience. Make sure you obey the rules. Whatever you do, don't get your license revoked. Oh, brother. If you ask me, that's a bit rich coming from Amber. Alright, we're done with the quest. Uh, in most cases, we're almost AR-10. Uh, not with one. So, as you can see, you need to go... Uh, animal CEO. I think this is Lisa. Lisa's quest? Let's check it out later on. So, so for now, that's all. Let's continue later then. Luckily, they improved the sequence of the quest. Like, it's not boring anymore. Huh. Not like last time, they had some gap. A uh, little long gap, though. So. Yeah. It's a good thing. So for now that's all. Hopefully you enjoy the series. And as always, thank you for hanging around. Subscribe for more and if you like the video, give it a like. And also as always, see you again next time. Bye bye. Thank you.